so it's it's 9 45 in the morning i've been awake since like five trying to clean up my presentation which i don't know if i'm having but symposium is at 2 30 i plan to leave home by 11 so that i can go there and find out am i presenting am i not presenting because um it wasn't finalized i tried sending a message but yeah <laughs> i didn't get a confirmation so i'm making a presentation for something that i don't know if i'm presenting but I just want to be prepared just in case they forgot to send me a confirmation and then they're like, oh no, you are presenting. Then I'm like, oh my god, I don't have a presentation. <sighs> yeah. I'm struggling with projector sizes because like newer projectors are using the whole wide 16 by 9 aspect ratio and the older projectors use a 4 by 3. I mean, you can change the settings when you're there. Um, yesterday at the, at, the, at the CPD, the first presenter, I guess, it, uh, she had done a presentation in, um, in I think, the old, in, in a six, in a 16, in the PowerPoint does 16 by 9 ratio as a standard. And so they're using, I think, an old projector and the projector put a standard 4 by 3. So some of her words were cut out. And she asked the technical team to come and fix it. And the technical team came, fidgeted with a lot of things, never to fix it. And us were just sitting there because, I'm like, first of all, as a technical team, you should know it's an aspect ratio quickly. Then I know at, at least half the people, the architects in that place, knew what was wrong. But people are just so, I don't know, how can I say? Um... Architects are just, they're just mean. I mean, they sat there and just looked at her and I'm like, and even I knew what was the problem, but I just sat there and I had to think, can someone just tell them to just change the image size? But we all just sat there and went through a 30 minute presentation with her, with like part of her words cut out because her, proje her project was on a wider screen. Painfully went through a 30 minute presentation. None of us even having the, courage to go up and tell her look just press your image site your aspect ratio and, and let's see the whole thing so when i saw that i had this thing of man i better choose my thing wisely and then if i'm going to present i better go like two hours earlier and look at the projector they're using and if i have to change the settings because i've chosen to use my settings one-to-one -one, an aspect ratio of one to one because my drawings were kind of like in a portrait form and most sc screens don't really do that portrait form you'll have those black lines on the side and i don't want those black lines so i did a one to one so i have to go early and tell the technical i don't even call the technical team it's just someone who's a computer and they don't even know how to use it anyway i'm going to hours earlier first to find out am i presenting if not okay i'll chill have lunch if I'm presenting, let's deal with technical now. I'm reading a nice book. Um, it's going to be my September read. Um, actually, I'll finish it probably in a week, so maybe I'll get another book. But it's called uh, Making a Presentation. It's an old book um, by these publishers, essential managers. I know there are many books probably have at publishing and what. But it's a really good book on just communicating, like... How to make an effective presentation i know it's, it may sound like ali that you do too much but it's really important especially if you're in a profession like mine where you have to present a lot it's it's good to know the cues it's good to know how to read your audience it's good to know how to prep for presentation because these guys even talk about visual um let me go there these guys even talk about visual presentations like how to prepare how to structure your presentation um how to match your presentation structure to material as in even just like anytime you go even standing positions like how to stand you know it's not good to lean on pulpits it's not good to you know it's not good to stand in one place especially if you have a, a younger it's, it's just good to walk around like there are many things I haven't finished reading the book um I do plan to finish reading it. I think I should have called yesterday and confirmed with them. 
I think that's something that I failed on my part to like call and be like, am I presenting tomorrow? I need to be told. The fact that I didn't, it's like, you know, it's partly my fault. So, so if they, they've already got someone else, I wouldn't blame them because, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to save this. I'm going to save it in all formats, in PowerPoint, in PDF, in Keynote. Like, I won't be caught sleeping because that's the stuff that used to mess me up during these two presentations. So now it's like, I can't prepare. I can't prepare. I make copies. I have my own hard drive because, you know, I'm in my own um, memory stick. As in, I'm ready for them. They're like, oh, you want PowerPoint? I got you. Because sometimes these guys have like an older version of PowerPoint and then you did in a newer version of PowerPoint and then you wish that things don't work. I'm like, no, if that's the case, let's do this PDF jazz and, you know, do a slideshow. Excito. I'm excited as if I've been confirmed that I'm presenting. <laughs> So I'm here in the bathrooms and uh, I actually, I'm actually going to present. Uh, there was no slot for me. They, they didn't have like a place for me to present, uh, but I came early. I came like two hours early and I was like, okay, I didn't get a confirmation and already made my presentation. So they were like, actually, no, I think we can squeeze you in. So they go, they have fixed up the program. You guys, when opportunity meets preparation, because if I hadn't prepared my presentation, they'd be like, oh, sorry, you couldn't do it. I'd be like, oh, it's okay, I didn't even make the presentation. So, eh. But now, it's like, I made the presentation. That's someone that's coming. I made the presentation, and now, I'm going to present. I'm kind of nervous. They asked for business cards I didn't have. But I'm just going to give the best presentation I can. Thank you. 